The Fox and the Stork, adapted from Aesop. Section 35 of In the Nursery of My Book House, read by Lauren Burwell. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. At one time, the fox and the stork were very good friends, and used often to visit each other. So, the fox invited the stork one day to dinner. But when they were ready to eat, Mr. Fox thought to play a joke on Miss Stork. He put before her nothing at all except some soup in a very shallow dish. This the fox could easily lap up with his tongue, but the stork could only wet the tip end of her long bill in it. So she could get nothing to eat and left the meal as hungry as when she began. I am sorry, said the fox, chuckling to himself, that you do not like the soup. Oh, pray you do not say anything about it said the stork i hope you will return this visit and come soon to eat dinner with me so a day was set when the fox should visit the stork but when they were seated at the table all that the stork had made ready for dinner was held in a very slim long-necked jar with a narrow mouth down into this the stork could easily reach her slender bill but the fox could not get his thick snout into it so all he could manage to do was lick the outside of the jar i will not say i am sorry you have eaten so little said the stork for as you treat others, you must also expect others to treat you. There was an old man with a beer who said, It is just as I fear two owls and a hen, four larks and a wren, have built their nests in my beard. Edward Lear. End of section 35.